A 15 year old Manatee County boy on a skateboard is dead tonight, struck by a hit and run driver. Tonight, investigators are still trying to track that driver down. Eight on your side's Victoria Price joins us now live in Bradenton. Just a heartbreaking story. Hey, Jen, good evening. It absolutely is. And I've learned that grief counselors, they will be on campus here at Horizons Academy tomorrow as they grieve the loss of one of their own. It's a dark scene at the intersection of Upper Manatee River Road and Waterleaf Boulevard. Sometime early Wednesday morning, it also became a crime scene, as seen from Eagle 8 HD. Florida Highway Patrol investigators believe a silver Toyota Tacoma hit and killed 15 year old Thomas Crombley as he tried to cross the street on his skateboard. The truck took off, but around 3 a.m., a passing ambulance noticed the debris and stopped, only to find his mangled body on the side of the road. I'm, I'm glad that they're the ones that found him and not someone going to school or someone walking their dog. It's unclear what Crombley was doing in that area at that hour. He was not wearing a shirt or a helmet. Investigators believe he did violate the right of way, so had the driver just stopped, he or she likely would not have been cited. Now, they're facing felonies. I don't know how you're living with yourself. I mean, I mean, I don't know if it was your fault or whatever, but you had to stop and see if what you could do and call somebody. I mean, it's just it's not even, it's, it's, it's not humane. A spokesperson with Manatee County Schools tells me the victim just transferred here to Horizons back in September. If you think you know anything, anything at all about that accident, you're urged to please contact the Florida Highway Patrol. Reporting live in Bradenton, Victoria Price, 8 on your side.